So I'm here at the Tesla supercharger in East Palo Alto um, and this supercharger looks differently from the other ones. I thought initially they were the first gen or like uh, the first model supercharger but um, through the comments on Twitter uh, Fred from Electric told me that this is actually um, the urban supercharger which Tesla just um, announced you know so that was a great opportunity for me so I just came back I thought to take another video just to show it for you um, so I have about 88 miles left on my battery um, on P100D Model S and I'm at the East Palo Alto supercharger and I'm very close to Ikea so I'm gonna spend the time um, there while the car supercharges and let me show you how they look so if you haven't seen this before this is how they look like um, definitely different from the other ones and each is tall like back to back they are next to each other and they look more like a, a gas station pump you know like a, a mini version one so let me grab the cable which looks exactly the same push the button and boom so you plug it in and it's rated at 72 kilowatt so let's have a look starting to charge all right I hear the click so now let's wait and see what's the max kilowatt we can pull off this one all right so 74 seems to be the max let me see what's the rating on this one so let me tap on the supercharger yeah so it says 72 kilowatt 11 out of 20 stalls are available so definitely I'm pulling more than 72 which is great and I'm not sharing you know the stall with anybody here so yeah outside you can see probably I would say these are the power pack so Tesla uses them to store energy to balance you know all this um, output for all these cars you know supercharging so they also look new so I'm gonna be heading to IKEA spend some time there then come back uh, regarding I guess the stall itself in order to get um, the information the Tesla call the service number it's it's kind of hiding behind the cable I wish to be honest with you now thinking about it Tesla would have posted them somewhere outside so they are more visible you know because right now it's kind of like a little bit inconvenience you know to see the number to call if the supercharger stopped working and the stall number is below here so yeah you can still see it So you can get about 284 miles per hour that would be let's see boom boom uh, kilometer Celsius um, so yeah um, around 450 or 460 kilometer per hour at 73 74 kilowatt and still says supercharging So over here you can see actually more Tesla power packs 
attached and this is how they look from the back these are all fans I guess yeah they are calling off the battery yeah this one is into spinning not sure if you guys can see it but yeah this one is spinning and I can feel some hot air coming 